If you're a lady and you're doing keto or intermittent fasting, there's some things that you need to implement into your life that your male counterparts may not need to implement. You see, for example, you could afford to have a little bit of estrogen in your body coming from soy, whereas men may not want to have that estrogen coming in. I'm going to explain how it works and exactly how you can take advantage of these little tips and tricks while utilizing cauliflower foods plant-based crust. You see, the cauliflower foods plant-based crust utilize cauliflower. So you have high levels of very powerful estrogen modulating compounds. Basically what that means is the cauliflower has the ability to take estrogen and make it less powerful or less dangerous. Let me explain. Normally, if you were to consume soy like edamame or tofu or anything like that, you have a high level of phytoestrogens. Okay, this is normally not that good, but if you're a lady, you can take advantage of this because you need a little bit of estrogen. It's actually good for you. You just don't want the phytoestrogens in their nasty, unhealthy form like you'd normally get from soy foods because what ends up happening is it turns into what's called 1,7-beta estradiol. This is the wrong kind of estrogen. We don't want this. We want smaller, easier to metabolize forms of estrogen within the female body. So what happens is utilizing the cauliflower that's in the plant-based cauliflower crusts, we can mitigate some of the negative impact from the soy. So what we end up doing is we end up with this end result where we get the estrogen that we want, but we utilize it in a way that's healthy for our bodies. Simply put, if you were to just veg out with a bunch of soybeans or veg out with a bunch of tofu, you would have the wrong kind of estrogen in your body. But if you put a little bit of tofu, you put a little bit of soybeans on your cauliflower foods pizza, then you get the counteracting effect from the cauliflower that's gonna take that estrogen and break it down so your body can actually use it as a good form not a bad form. It's pretty intriguing, pretty deep stuff, but the reality is you're going to get more out of keto and more out of your intermittent fasting lifestyle if you get the adequate hormone modulating effects that you need. So don't shy away from the soy. Just make sure you're eating it along with a healthy cauliflower foods crust. As always, make sure you're keeping it locked in here with cauliflower and I will see you in the next video.